everybody, Merry Christmas. I'm going to do the annual What I Got for Christmas 2020. Oh, I had a really good Christmas. Very good, good Christmas. I'm very thankful for what I have. I'm grateful. Um, I'm not bragging any shape or form. Things I needed or, you know, want to do, you know, have. Um, things I didn't know. Um, uh, let's see. I don't think I got anything on my wish list. No. Nope. Nothing on my wish list, but that's okay. There's certain things I told my mom and dad I wanted or like point. Oh, I like to have that. Or, you know, always want one something like that. You know, that thing. So, yeah. All right. So, I'm going to show what I got early Christmas, like in November, because um, that usually happens. Um, so, I, first thing I got were these Christmas earrings, these are gingerbread. Hollies with bells that don't really jingle, but it'd be cool if they did. And then the last pair are these Santa Claus. So I got those early Christmas because I needed some new earrings. And then my mom got me, because she's like obsessed with Amazon, she got me some window doodads with gnomes and these are snowflakes. So she got me a lot of this. So she got me this one. This one. So how are everybody's going? How's Christmas? You get what you get, what you needed or want. Snowflakes, you shit snowflakes. Another one. I know there's a lot. There's a lot. There's another one. They're for the window, by the way. Another one. I like the string of lights. That's cool. And this was snowflakes and then Merry Christmas and white. That's kind of cool. And the last one is a lady. So cute. Alright, so that's what I got. And then I also got a Christmas card. Like in, I think, in December or so. But for my grandpa. So, yeah. And then my mom saw these on Facebook Market. And she got one, and she gave me this one. So it's an early Christmas present. Um, a lady had a couple of these. Uh, these are um, I can't I can't think right now. Um, Boeing. These are Boeing Bears, the airline. Okay, then. I needed a winter coat because of quarantine or, you know, before quarantine, I, you know, gained some extra weight. So my coat that I had, my other winter coat, um, still kind of fits me, but a little snug. So I need a, another one. I'm still keeping that one. But this one will keep me warm. And it's just this guy. And the cool thing about this, let's see, it stretches. So that is cool that it stretches. I tried on an XL large or 3X, and I was like, oh, this is nice. And then it put the thing around because it has buttons here and on the other side, so you can switch which side you want. And it has a strap that goes around your waist. Um, anyways. 
I put it on and I'm like, ooh, this is nice. It's warm, it's warm in here, and the hoodie part is warm, but the arm sleeves is not warm, so that's that's good. Um, anyways, I uh, you know did that and I'm like, I you know pull. You know usually that's your reactions to do that, and then try and see if it fits. You know the arms and all that stuff, and I'm like, what? This stretches. I'm like. Okay, I need to go down a size. So, I went down to a 2X, and it still fits me. Um, I still have plenty of room and stuff, but at least it's better than the 3X, because I was swimming, and plus it stretches. I, you know, it's nice to down a size. Anyways, yeah, so yeah, I've been wearing this, and I love it. Keeps me super warm, and yeah, this was my early Christmas present. And this was shocking me because of this coat. It seems expensive. It was only $17.99. Like, what? Yeah. Mm, yeah. I know. It was a great deal. Oh, get down my bed. All right. Next. Okay, my uh, Christmas Eve present that I open is always a pair of pajamas I just got these guys oh that's okay that's okay I don't need to show that much um I have the bottoms on I was wearing this and then I woke up and I was sweating because I had a starting getting a cold over the week and I think I uh, sweated out my cold so I took this off and just put a regular shirt on. Um, but these stretch. Um, <laughs> Mom gave me a 3X over the top and I'm like swimming in it, but that's okay. Um, and the bottoms are extra large and they're so comfy. That pockets and they cinch at the ankle. Um, so yeah, they're very, very comfy. All right, on to what I got for Christmas. Sorry, I'm talking too fast. I just, you know, want to talk and all that stuff. Anyways, let's see. Where do we want to start? Let's start with stocking stuffers and small little bits. I just put in this um, Xfinity bag. So, uh, let's see what's in the bag. I'm going to put it on the side for you guys. So, first thing I pulled out is this mini storage doodad it's kind of cool just one so that's nice I'm just gonna put it on the dog bed uh let's see here let's do this piece of clothing i got this shirt really cool flannel i like the color it needs a wash because it smells like this and then i got these um, cool, um, lavender, shea butter infused, um, slippy sock thingies, and then the little, um, lavender dad you can put in your, um, drawer, and, uh, I'm gonna give this to my mom because it's very, very lavender and very potent, and it's burning my nose right now. <laughs> I really like them, it's just that is a bit too much lavender. In that little pouch next I got these socks because I needed some socks my first idea socks like wow why are you hard right there anyways I got some cool socks And then, my first ever Santa. I never had a Santa, and it's cool that he's black. So that's very nice. Was my heritage, or my ethnic. Um, so, be cool. So yeah, and he has cute slippies, and he's having coffee. So yeah. 
sorry. Oh, you're in the way. You are in the way, sir. Okay, in here are my stocking stuffers. So, I have a Hobby Lobby gift card, $20. That's my first thing I got. And then, this is so pretty. I'm like, what is this thing? This is so pretty, pretty, pretty. Oh, it's for you. So pretty. It's one of those evil eyes. I'm just going to put it right there on my iPad case. And then, along with that, I, well, not with it, but I have a gift card for the watermark book kind of store whatever it is and um i'm just gonna cover that in um our, our town and then i got a uh do that to put on a coat or whatever let me get out these guys Then I got this magnet. And I got this other magnet. So cool. And then I got my first cup holder. Oh, because we've been using my dad's for our hot chocolate. Um, because we have Starbucks um reusable cups from last year and we use them for like hot drinks and stuff so her it gets real hot so yeah and then i got this little happiness pocket buddha and there's the other ones when watching after yourself you watch after others when watching others, you watch after yourself. The Buddha. Oh, wow. I was reading the that. That's cool. Let's see what he looks like. Open up Buddha. Oh, he's so cute. My first little Buddha. Oh, my God. He's so cute. Look at him. He's so cute. Ugh. Adorable. Put him right there. That's cute. Alright. And then the last thing in my stocking. I got this really cute ornament angel. That lights up. Oops, sorry. That changes colors. That's cute. Alright. Oh. And then over here, I'll just do the few things I have over here. I got this hat that's actually, you know, to make a ponytail. You can have your hair through there. So I'm like, ooh, yes. I can wear that. And I like the color. And then, okay. And then I got a big mug. Because, you know, you can put, I can put soups in here. That'd be cool. Um, anyways, I'm going to share this with my mom because I like to share. Caring is sharing. Okay. I'm going to do you last. All right. Then I got some plushies. I got this dinosaur and his name is Miles. So meet Miles with his little, little tail. Sorry, Miles. All right. And then, next, is this cat. Yummy. Okay, cat name is... I don't know. Yeah, okay. And then... Boom. It's a dog. It's a reversible one. So... Yeah, I have a cat and a dog. I think that's enough plushies. Squishies. Alright. So, I have a couple more things. I have my first, I don't have the elf, 
I have the storybook. That's okay. I have still a child in heart. Anyways, so I got my very first Elf on the Shelf book. And plus I watched the cartoon ones. Okay, and then I got me myself a candy lamb. Well, I didn't get myself, but I got a candy lamb game. Because I used to play that. I used to have one. And then I'm like, oh my gosh. There's a game. I'm like, what? It's a naughty or nice board game. I'm like, what? That is so cool. Oh, and that's what it looks like. That is so cool. I'm so stoked to play that. All right. All right, last two things. So, I think I'm going to do this next one. Let me um clean my, my desk a little bit here. So this guy, Ugh, he's a big one. Okay. I, I think this is the only thing I'm going to get for a while, gnome-wise. I got a Christmas gnome that actually, what's that? Well, well, yeah. Well, it does go all the way up. Uh, but yes, he has a bell. That's what you're hearing. So, uh, we need to name this guy. He's going to go with all his gnome friends over there. Because I have a couple of gnome people. When you get one gnome, you have to get a few more gnomes. Because they need buddies. They get lonely. Oops, sorry dude. Didn't mean to do that. Alright. The final thing I got for Christmas warn you it's going to be noisy it's going to be noisy for a while during the video but um i hope you can hear me oh by the way i have the window open because i was really warm going up and down the stairs so i'm gonna shut the window all right last thing This Furby, and I don't want to wake him up. Um, this is a Chewbacca Furby, and it's the newer one with the um, um, LED lights that move and stuff. So he's sleeping right now. I don't want to wake him up. But oh my god, oh my god, he's so cute. Does not have an on and off button. So, uh, he just goes off when he's done with his cycle. So, I don't want him to go on. Um, but yeah. I got myself a Furby. So, I have a old witch one. The original. And now, I have a new digital one. So, so that's that's my big... Uh, one right there. Okay. <sighs> Okay, I wasn't sure it was going to go off or anything, so I just want to warn you guys and stuff. Anyways, I am very grateful what I got for Christmas, early Christmas, and to now. Um, I'm just blessed. I work hard, especially with helping with the Meals on Wheels. Um... I do, you know, I deserve these things. Um, I love having games. I, you know, I'm just a kid at heart still. Um, so I'm very grateful what I got. Um, I hope you guys understand. Um, yeah. Okay. Anyways. who such a long video. Um, excuse me. I hope you guys having a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful Christmas. Or if you don't celebrate Christmas, I hope you have a wonderful holiday. Um, anyways, to be with your loved ones or a few of your loved ones. 
be doing a lot of Zoom calls, um, making sure everybody's okay, um, just stay positive for the new year. I love you guys, and please be safe out there. It's been a very rough um, year, especially with not just the, the virus, but other things happening that's very sad. Um, especially like yesterday, there was things happening yesterday. It was like, whew, I hate when the holidays come and things happen like that. Um, anyways, I hope you're doing well. And I'll talk to you January 1st on my update on what I'm going to do in January and then 2021. Oh, God, that's so weird to say. Wow. Anyways, yes, I'm going to go hang out and just have a wonderful day. Help mom. <coughs> Excuse me. Help my mom if she needs some help in the kitchen. And all that stuff. Um, so yeah. I'll see you. In the new year. Or maybe. Well not in the new year. Maybe a couple days. I don't know. I might, I'm might. i thinking I'm taking a couple days off. And then. Yeah I think I'm going to take a couple days. Well it depends. I'm, no. I'm going to do some videos. End of. December, and then I'll, you know, see you in the new year, well, a couple days off, but I'll get to that when it gets closer, um, see you, I think Saturday, tomorrow, I think tomorrow, we'll see, we'll see how I feel tomorrow, if I feel motivated to film, um, so yeah, I'll see you tomorrow, and, uh, yeah. Bye, guys.